so just spare a few more minutes with me before you go. Last December, my husband and I, for months back then, we have been praying to have our second child. For those of you who know, meron po akong two-year-old boy. And matagal na namin pinag-decide to have our second child. And last December, we found out that I was pregnant. But before you clap, as you can see now, that didn't happen. Because two weeks later, that good news turned sour after we found out that we lost our child. And magpapasko noon, we were broken hearted, we were, I was angry at God, I was disappointed, I was broken. Tinatanong ko kay Lord, Lord, paano kami magpapasko? Pasko, pasko. I was asking the Lord, how do I have a Merry Christmas when I have this? Back then, my, my little boy would already call himself Kuya Kyler. We even bought a medical insurance to cover the maternity benefits. And I was just depressed, disappointed, and doubtful of God. But in one of our feast sessions, I was crying out to God in worship. And we were singing that song, I Can Trust You. And it went, I trust in the one who sustains every life, who cares for the hidden and small. And at that moment, I just knew the Lord was speaking into my heart and was telling me, I care for your unborn, hidden little one more than you can. And I just felt at that moment that my heart was overwhelmed with peace. And I began to trust again, trust God again, that I know my little one is in good hands. And that I know that in His perfect time, our the third child will come. Friends, this is the power of worship. This is what we get to have in worship. This is the power of the presence of Jesus. When we come into worship, we don't just sing empty lines. We don't just spew out nicely put together creative lines, words. When we sing out in worship, we are confessing with our lips, professing with our lips, each all truths that hold the power of Jesus, that guard our hearts from fear, from doubt, and so that's why feast worship. We wanna always try to provide a space for you, when you, where you can just be in the presence of Jesus and just believe, confess together truths that will guard our hearts. And so we wanna invite you to believe again. Worship night. It's a night of prayer and praise where we get to just be together as a community. Believe again. Siguro meron sa inyo mga nangarap na biguna. We want to believe again, we want to ask again, we want to dream again and believe in the power that our God can. And so we will be outside, uh, we'll be at the ticket booth, and we hope that you can join us for that night of worship. Thank you very much. Amen. Thank you for sharing that, Bea. First timers or first timers?